hello guys and welcome back to another video and in this video i'll be doing a monthly recap of the small count challenge and overall i'll be i'll be giving a recap on you know what we did uh in the small count challenge and what's the plan in the near future so as you guys uh know we started two small count challenges one on robin hood with one thousand dollars and one on thinkorswim with one thousand and seven hundred the robin hood account is at three thousand and seven hundred right now we did hit 4002 um on thursday and uh this robin hood account hit around 5000 uh so from 1700 to 5000 i did add in uh 2000 to buy in some more baba leaps um right over here so um overall both of those accounts hit 20 percent uh and i am looking to make uh the third small account challenge at 2000 subscribers on youtube as well as 1000 followers on twitter so make sure to drop a follow on twitter as well as subscribe on youtube if you guys want to see uh, another small account challenge now recap on what we did um so we played the apple breakout and again we had this charted out we had this coming out and it paid uh very well so we had a whole month on our contracts and we got our contracts around right over here at 125 levels so if i should go to my robinhood account and i search up aapl okay so right around apple i scroll down uh right around over here and you guys can see on june 15th so around June 15th, right around over here, we, we have entered in at this breakout level and we sold right around over here at all time high. So 144. So that was a very nice 200 uh, percent return for us on the small account challenge. And again, that was our first play and we made a lot uh, with that play. And then we moved on to our next play, which was Alibaba and Alibaba. This play is going to be crazy. We sniped the bottom, legit the bottom, right at 200. 200 was that mental number. And uh, my plan for this play is to play the earnings run up, and my goal is 231. So essentially, I want a 50% return on the small account challenge. And as long as if, you know the account hits. Uh, 5,000 by Alibaba earnings. I'm looking to cash out uh, of the 5,000 uh, on it. And keep in mind that our goal is 5% a week. And later on, I'll be explaining a little bit uh, more in depth. You know, 5% a week is our goal with the small account challenge. So, you know, leaps, they are long term plays. So, our risk is very, very low. And I'm looking to sell before earnings. So, if we can hit this level 230, I'm looking to cash out on Alibaba. And this play is very, very nice. My stop loss right now is at BE. Okay. So, at break even is the stop loss right now and currently we are up 20 percent on the leap we were up 30 percent uh last week on thursday and again same with the uh this account you know um it's a little bit uh of a private account uh but if you guys want the third small account challenge make sure um to subscribe and follow me on twitter so overall again the strategy with the small accounts is uh, you know, long uh, expirations, a lot of time on our contracts, something that we are confident on. And as you guys can see on the week, we have this very nice falling wedge. And keep in mind that Alibaba is at 2018 levels. This is a very undervalued stock. And keep in mind that earnings show the true value of the company. So we will be seeing a run up uh, for Alibaba. And then the next place I've in mind is probably airlines and couple in couple weeks or, or a couple months um but i don't know about the next play yet i am also looking at crsr uh but for right now we are only holding baba great play on apple uh and overall see you guys next week and thank you for watching